Hi friends and welcome or welcome back to a new episode of our fairy core let's play. In the last episode we built this cozy kitchen <laughs> and today I think we are going to start off by moving the enchanting setup so I'm just gonna jump straight in <laughs> and chop all of this down. Oh did that just that broke that whoops okay <laughs> I'll have to get some more decorations and we obviously need our enchanting table and I think I'm gonna just put it over in this room it'll fit perfectly back here and just be a little bit cozier in between episodes I also um got some more ancient debris I went down and did a little bit of strip mining so that was cool because I want to try to upgrade the backpack to the um, like ancient debris level I mean the netherite <laughs> level okay so I think that'll be there and then if we just like sprinkle obviously all the book shelves around I will need some torches I made my um, GUI one size bigger so you can all see everything a bit better. Let me know what you think about that if you like it bigger or you're happy with it a bit smaller how it was before as well. Make sure I get all of the different variation. Oh, <laughs> there's a lantern right there. Different variation. Oh, I can't do it. Make sure I get all the different bookshelf variations, mixing them around. It's two of the same one there, but I think it'll be okay. Or should I move it? Uh, do someone said this looks like a chicken head, and I guess it kind of is. I thought it was a bottle, like with the cork and like stuff inside it, but it does also look like a chicken head. So <laughs> that's pretty funny. Um, do that one there. I think something like that. Um, where did the barrel go? Or is it in my backpack? Am I blind? Where did the barrel go? Oh, I didn't. <laughs> it's still here. Why are you not breaking? There we go. Mm, yep. <laughs> oh, except I didn't pick it up, did I? Nope. Because there's too many books. Okay. There we go. Could probably, like, put bookshelves across the top. I might also take this down for a second. Could actually just like pop it somewhere and then maybe a cuter light or just more books up there. Can't put those ones in there. But can put those ones in there. Okay, so if oh, oh, I do that every time. <laughs> If I pop the ones that I can't put put in bookshelves in there, what about the Alex's mobs one? No, okay. And oh, all of these book and quill ones I'll pop in there. They were from the library. Then grab our decorations. The glow berries can stay in here for now. <laughs> Cute. I might grab some um, glowstone to put in the roof with the azalea like we have been doing everywhere else. Where is it? Oh, it's right in front of me. <laughs> put another one in. Over here, I think. Another one, like over here, maybe. 
Oh, wrong tool. And maybe like a second one just here. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, and then I have a flint and steel, I think, in my backpack. So I can light those. Um, I'll ignore all the backpacks. I was <laughs> in um, my skelly spawner and got a whole bunch from over there. So that's pretty cute. I like that. I might put... Hmm. Do we want like more bookshelves around or I guess I could see what furniture options I have for like other sort of bookshelves um, that might be like decorative and stuff. Oh, I forgot there was like heaps of the colored ones too. Obviously they don't work with the enchanting stuff, but they could be cool for decoration. Okay, I have an idea. Ooh, that's really cute too. Three books and three planks. Let's make some of those as well. Okay. So I need some books. Oh, <laughs> I'm going to keep walking into there thinking that's where my stuff is still. Um, grab the books. And um, we need some wood. So, oh, there's like heaps of different book decorations. Hmm, okay. Interesting. I definitely want some of these though. And then I wanted just some vanilla bookshelves, but I'm going to need more books. Do I have much paper? <laughs> no, I do not. Oh, actually, that reminds me. Someone in the comment section said I can claim my area um, in the map. So I'm not sure how to do that. The chunk claim feature requires the open parties and claims mod. Okay, I might quickly do that and be right back. I've added the mod needed for this. So how do I claim my chunks? There we go. Okay. Another thing I did was change the waystone um, settings a little bit in config to ha ha always have a well, yeah to always have a waystone in villages. So that won't change the ones I've already found. But if we're out traveling and find one, then they will definitely have one. So that is cool. Another subscriber um, recommended I use easy villages as well. So I have installed that, and I'm not going to play around with that today. But I just thought I'd add it in at the same time. Um, as the others. So what was I doing? We need paper, which means we need sugar cane. And I don't think I technically have any planted right now. Um, where is it? Okay, so I've got still a bit there. I can make a little bit of paper for now. So paper and books, that's what I'm doing. So I, I will make some paper. There we go. <laughs> uh, uh, that's still not going to be enough, but I need to save some paper for planting. Okay. That's better. Now if I make a few more vanilla bookshelves. And then we go over to uh, maybe the carpenter's bench. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh my god, that one's got little plants. That's so cute. I don't think you can get the chipped bookshelves with the other colours. Oops. No, it's just the regular ones. That's okay. Um, I definitely want some spider webs. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Ooh, that one's cute too. Uh oh, I've already <laughs> used them all up. Okay, we'll see what those ones look like. We can make more later as... Oh, I guess I can harvest that while I'm here because it's in my way. 
So my thoughts were if I, oh, whoops, didn't mean to break both of those, but that's fine. For example, like pop one there and then maybe like another one there because they sort of like blend together and then in the corners here. Oh, that's so cute. Could like pop a few different ones around and I might get a few more purple ones to mix in as well and then have it like as just as a full on library. I can pop that one there so I can put all of these back. Okay, I'm gonna grab a few more of the purple shelves, <laughs> bookshelves, and I'll be right back. Okay, I've got a whole bunch of bookshelves back. I am going to probably move that one as well and maybe put that one up there I think and then move the other bookshelf down yeah we'll do that and then I'll pop like maybe that one there although then that's kind of too similar to that but I can move that one maybe like there and I'll put purple ones in between I think that'll work all the books back in yeah so I have this one which is a new design because I didn't have the recipe switching thingy on before but I do now so that's cool but keep it kind of looking a little bit random I don't know I feel like I need maybe like one more there or something but I do have quite a lot of different decorative books oh my god so cute so you get three single books but you can stack them individually <laughs> so that's cool oh my god stop it look how cute that one is <gasps> the little flowery green book oh my gosh oh no I want to put you on top that is so cute. Oh, um, <laughs> that's a bit bigger than I was expecting. So maybe I'll move that. Put the oh, but then you can't see the cute books. Okay. Um. Oh, <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I just got rid of the whole the wall. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um. <laughs> That was an accident. Oh, yellow book, okay. Oh my gosh, and it went all the way around the sides. <laughs> ah, okay, I will fix this quickly. Okay, I fixed the walls. <laughs> I think it was, was it Creathena in her All the Mods series that's got, she's got like a house axe that she uses for when she's building with her house because the same thing happens to her and like it happened to her. She like accidentally tore down half her house with the <laughs> timber um, enchant or whatever. So I think this spot is looking really cute. It's very bookish. Oh, I could put that painting back on the wall. Um, could even put it big one yeah well oh actually we need more of those moons <laughs> I'm probably gonna put way too many around but they're just so cute okay yes I love it okay I'm way more happy with this space now what do you all think let me know down in the comments I just I'm obsessed with this um, oh enchantment power that counts as enchanting books <gasps> That's cool. So the rest are up. Oh, that one does. Interesting. Okay. Oh, that one's. Ooh, okay. Interesting. Um. Yeah, anyway, sorry. I really like this space now. I think it's really cute. I probably could put something on the wall there, but I might leave it. Otherwise, it might be too cluttered. Actually, I do want to craft those 
flat or carpet things. Where were they? This one. Grass and I think it can be any flowers. Yeah, okay. For some reason it didn't work when I tried to turn off those chunk um, notifications. So if anyone knows how to do that, please, please, please let me know. Now, I think if I put it too close to the enchanting table, it will affect the enchants. So I'll just sprinkle a couple around there. And I think that's pretty cute. Yeah, I like that. You can't put these ones on the walls. <gasps> you can put them on the walls. No way. Oh my gosh. Uh, so we're going to put them everywhere now. <laughs> We need any in here? Probably not, but <laughs> I'll do it anyway. <laughs> okay, um, next up. Hmm. Someone suggested like making a lounge room, like living room, which would be pretty cool. Okay, I think we will do the lounge room next. So I'm just gonna take down the glow berries for now and we'll have a look at what stuff we've already got that we can use in our chests for like decoration and furniture and stuff. So probably another moon, <laughs> maybe hanging plants, maybe our cute planters. Um, not sure if I'll use any of the purple furniture because I do have something else I want to try. I think that'll be all from there for now. And then in this one, I could probably use a frog nightlight. <laughs> that could be cute. And yeah, we'll see what else we. Oh, actually, maybe some candles. But I want to try and have a look and see what this looks like. And then if I need to make more of them, I will. But I thought maybe that would be cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm not actually sitting in it. Oh. Okay, I guess I can't sit in that one. That's fine. It's just decorational then. <laughs> uh, yeah, but that's pretty cute. I like the little pink base bit. I think that kind of goes with the stuff. Um, okay, I'll make another one and we'll go from there. Maybe one of the singular armchairs? I'm not sure. Or do I make two of the plain? Oh, I need more colored wool. Um, red and blue. Oh no. Oh, uh, yeah, that's way too much red wool, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, ooh, checkered block. That's cute. What am I missing? Oh, I need more fences. Probably more again. Maybe one more. And another piece of blue wool. And then I should be able to make two of those. There we go. So maybe if I move it... Oh, no! <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> no, and it ruined all of the stuff on my wall. <laughs> That's it, I'm getting a new axe. I'm gonna fix this and be right back. Okay, I have an iron axe. I'm only going to use... No. Oh. The hitboxes on that furniture is really strange. Okay. <laughs> um, ooh, we're gonna have an issue if we do it that way because it's an even room and that's an odd chair. So if I go, guess that one that way, but then hang on, how many spaces does that? Yeah, it is only two, but then that's two, but across two, okay, that's, Strange, but that's fine. Why does that one look bigger than that one, or is it just perspective? <laughs> um, okay, if I go 
something like that. And then we'll need a coffee table of sorts. We can pop our cat planner in the corner maybe? Or should it be on a table? Oh, this is too hard. Um, unless we just like pop the cat planner like there or something. That's kind of cute. <laughs> okay, coffee table and we need like lighting as well. Oh, I got that out as well. I could pop that somewhere, I think. Oh my god, it's tiny. Okay, that's not what I thought it would look like. That's fine. It's still cute. Um... Okay, we need more furniture first. Do I stick with this collection in the cluttered series? Ooh, that's really cute though. Purple carpet and the sewing table. Oh, so it's not a coffee table. I thought it was a coffee table. Um, decorative shelves. Round table. Look how cute. And cottage court those are. They are so cute. Oh, and the black one. Doesn't really go with, I think, the vibe we're going for in this room, but it is very cute. Okay, these are really cute. Spruce table. So I need some sticks and spruce planks. All right. I think I can do that. Do I still have... I do still have spruce on me. I forget how to make planks. There we go. Maybe a couple more sticks. I'll grab one of those because that's cute also. <laughs> Except now I need more planks. Okay, let's have a look at these, I guess, as little side tables. Maybe not that one there. I do think that's cute though. I do like that. And then we also have this brown desk. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Um, no. <laughs> doesn't exactly match the spruce but I think it's still cute. I'll have to think of what carpet I want for on the floor. Let's make a couple of white carpets but I am going to put them in the loom. Yeah okay so I'll just double check it works with the yeah the carpets as well. It's cubed. Maybe I should do the big blocks first. I think I'll give the string to go. Actually, I might not need to put... Uh, I should probably get the table I want first. There was an ottoman that I could use, actually, as like a little coffee table. Wasn't this... Oh, maybe it was the stool I was looking at then. I change it for white? Oh, because I changed it all to... I'm a silly goose. Okay. Um, I really need more wool. Yeah, three. So I'm thinking it should be able to maybe make them into a bigger stool. Because I just like wanted to create a diff like a little bit of height variation, actually. That works. It does doesn't really like line up perfectly because of the way that those chairs sit but I think that's okay oh but it's gonna look dumb if I do white carpet hmm okay let me think I was just flying over to get more wool that's the pillages have spawned on the lily pads that's pretty funny <laughs> uh, all right and I'm just grabbing some wool because I need some more carpet. Okay, I think I like that for the rug. I know it's not technically a rug and I do like to add some wool blocks and wool like carpets to add a bit of like kind of texture. So I think I like that. I'm not sure about the end table, but the rest of it's pretty cool. We can't sit anything on there though because it is 
obviously a half block, but that's okay. I think next I'm going to make, uh, I think I can make it now. Yeah, the sewing table. And then I think I needed was a white wool carpet. Oh, that probably isn't it. But to make the cute, where'd it go? Ooh, that's a cool desk too. Interesting. Okay, uh, I'm getting distracted though. This one. Oh no, purple carpet. Okay, so purple carpet. I'll need two normal carpets and two purple dye. No, not pink. Purple. And then we can make this. Oh my god, it is so cute. Um I guess I'll pop it there. And then what we need to do next is grab some string and iron. String and iron. And we can make a vintage or antique sewing machine. Look how cute that is. Oh, it's even got flowers on it. Oh, that is big. <laughs> what well, I don't like it from that angle. Can I rotate you? Oh, now it's on the floor. <laughs> Uh, so now it's just got the cute flower on that side, even though I guess that's technically around the wrong way. We'll just pretend I'm left-handed or something. <laughs> My mum's left-handed. That Yeah, we'll just pretend. Um, what else? So I just want to add more cluttered stuff basically to the house, I think, because that would be pretty cute. So for this I need a pot, a book and a candle. I don't have any of those things. Cool. I've got candles here. Actually, I'll keep them on me. Why not? And I have to grab a book. It's our last book. So I think I will move this maybe to next to there. Um, yeah. I think that's okay. This is hard. Um, plants maybe. Or I've also got that little itty bitty shelf. I can add more so it's a bit longer. Lighting. I'll do the lighting in the roof quickly. Okay, so here's how the room is looking now. I moved these over and we've got the light in this roof and everything. Um, so it's looking cute. I think I need a chair for this desk. So I'm going to quickly go try plant plant try to make one of those i think i need more oh no i've got a bit of spruce um so we would like a chair that goes with the no we don't want jungle spruce that one looks boring that looks too decorative i guess i can see like what cluttered ones there are because that would Hopefully be in like the same sort of style. Maybe. Ooh, they're cute. Definitely want to try and make one of these glow shroom terrariums too. They look really cute as well. Oh, there's too many cute decorations. <laughs> okay, so I guess there isn't chairs that match. I think I'll give this one a go. We'll see what it looks like if it's like the right sort of proportions for the desk. It's not really the right color, but I think I can live 
with that. Yeah, that's kind of cute. Okay. Uh, over here, do some shelves, I think. Like floating sort of shelves. I know I had some before, but I'm not sure what color they were. Because they're the small shelves. Okay, I, best, I probably should check which ones I do have before I start making a whole bunch of more. So I've got one of the small ones. I don't want fur shelves. So yeah, I'll have to probably make some bigger spruce ones. Maybe something like that. No, we'll do that. Oh, I need sticks. Okay. Okay, probably didn't need six, but we'll give it a go. I mean, I don't hate it. Then could probably pop a small one there. The small ones are cute, but it's harder to put stuff on them. We'll give it a go. Um, and then I was gonna maybe see what like... <laughs> what? <laughs> No, oh, no, no, <laughs> how do I? What in the world? Okay, I guess I'll just do it <laughs> that way. I keep destroying half of my house. Okay, there we go. That's what I was trying to do. Oh my God, look how cute that hanging dish towel is. <laughs> Adorable. Um. Oh, and there's a different what? I need to make that one. I need like all of the items though. Um, hang on. Let's just pop a few things we don't need in there for a minute. <laughs> we need some of that. We need glass. Okay, what else was I looking at? We've got two types of the potted hanging plants. Um, yes. Let's give that a go as well. That's so cute. Oh, it's too much cute stuff. So if I grab a few mushrooms. I'm going to probably need more glass. Why am I forgetting how to make panes? Oh, I was close. So that means I could make the ooh terrarium. Yes. Oh, there's a pink one too. Too late. Um. Ooh, decorative mushroom. Wait. So there's that um moon and star string and that one, which is different. Plus that one. So if I. Change up this one to that one. No, they are different. They do kind of line up, but not really. That is so strange. Okay, there's just two different versions. And then we have this one. Whoa, okay, that's cool. It's like 3D. Um, maybe in the corner? I, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and then I needed a little bit more glass to make some glass bottles. Okay, what else can I make? Sewing clutter? That would be cute. Um, wait, that is an adorable teapot. <laughs> Um, salt and pepper. That nightstand, adorable. Okay, what does this look like? Mini hanging. So, is it supposed to be like a shelf? Or is it not supposed to be like a shelf? Probably 
pretty cute. Just not really sure where I should put it. Because is that the same depth as the small shelf? Oh, it's even shorter. Interesting. Okay, well, for now, I think I'm going to put... Why do I keep doing that? Pop that back there, and I want the books that way. Yeah, okay. And then if I put some shelves back over here... Although there is this one that's... That's pretty cute, actually. But then where do I put the terrarium? I guess I can put that there instead of books. But then that's two glass things next to each other. Ah. <laughs> Maybe something like that? That's kind of cute. And then I've got like one painting here. Whoa. <laughs> that is huge. Oh my god, what? <laughs> is that like the only option? <laughs> um... <laughs> So let's try. No, okay. These are all like cork boards. <laughs> okay, are they the only ones in that size range? Guess so. Um. Let's try... No, I can't do that. Okay. Maybe that? I want some plants, but I'm not sure how to do that. Because there is planter boxes, but they don't really go with like the vibe. I guess I could maybe do one of these. Or that one. Make, well, well, I guess I'll make two and see how they look. Kind of wish they didn't have like the dark green grass on top, but hopefully, I guess a plant would like cover that a bit. Hmm, okay. Wait, I did have a plant on me. Of course, that one has to sit kind of off centered. <laughs> just feel like the room still needs something else, but I'm not sure what. I mean, I don't hate that planner though, it does kind of go with all the other brown furniture. Do I have any item frames? Okay, what if we put. Actually, I might swap out. Nope, not that one. Uh, this one. Whoa, that's huge though. <laughs> yeah, no, that's too big. Um, I'm 
think I'll leave it as the other one. Actually, or does that look a little bit too small? Yeah, no, we won't do that. We'll leave it as the pink snapdragons. I think that's a good size. But I think it looks cute when I put... Um, why is that one invisible? Are they invisible frames? No. Are they? I guess they are. Okay. <laughs> um, it just says item frame. No, I don't want to put the item frame. Okay, well I might go get a few more item frames <laughs> that aren't invisible. Why are all the normal ones invisible? What? I forget how my invisible item frame mod works. Am I being dumb? I know in my other world you cheer, but that doesn't... Yeah, no, um... Okay, I just dyed a couple <laughs> um, brown to see. Yeah, that works. Okay, because I just wanted a few kind of normal color ones, but I had to dye them first. But that's fine. <laughs> um, I've got one more flower left there. Maybe something like that. And then I also had the frog light. Maybe... Oh, that noise always scares me. She can just live there. <laughs> okay, what are we thinking? Is it done? Do we like it? It's a little sitting room. Oh, I, yeah, I can't sit in those chairs. But I think I can sit in this one actually, which is kind of funny. Um, yeah, so what do you all think? Let me know down in the comments. Would you have changed anything or done anything differently? I think I like it. We'll see if I end up changing anything or not. That's normally, you know, a sign that I'm not happy with it, is if I rearrange things later. But I think that's where I'm going to leave this episode for now. So let me know what you think down in the comments. Um, if you haven't already, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!